Joe Zekas from Yo Chicago. I'm with Melissa Govederica. And uh, I think we're going to disappoint everybody today because we're looking at a house that's sold. We are, yeah. And what was the asking price on this? $799.9. And we're three bedrooms, three and a half baths? We've got uh, two bed three bedrooms upstairs, uh, three full baths, a half bath, and then the lower level has a media room, which could also couple as another bedroom and an another bedroom. So really five bedrooms. So you could go up to five yeah. if, you, if you needed them. Right. And you wouldn't have any trouble getting everybody around the counter space in this kitchen. No, it's a phenomenal kitchen. It's a fantastic kitchen. Great space, great cabinets. Nice look, very sleek. Nice uh, lighting all the way around, which characterizes this builder. Very unusual and tasteful lighting. Yep, again, he, he loves his lights, loves his lighting. There's a lot of it. Very unusual, too. And we're in an unusually long home here. Well, the lot's 125, so he maxed out what he could do with it. What's nice is you've got this great balcony out the back with um, uh, their. Uh, Two levels, so the party can flow. Thank you, and, and uh, maintenance-free decking. That's what I was trying to get out. So, and the roof garage is huge. For people like me, everything is maintenance-free <laughs> because, because we, we just don't maintain it. It's <laughs> that's pretty funny. Uh, but great kitchen, fully appliance. You've got double ovens, 31 inch. You've got microwave built in, of course. Zephyr hood vents to the exterior, five burner stove, built in espresso maker. Built in uh, desk, which is a nice touch. It's built something you desk. see typically only in suburban homes or large custom homes. Right, iPod docking station, of course. You've got uh, drawers that light up when you open them. And then a separate serving buffet over here with a wet bar. It's a wet bar, butler's pantry, if you want to call it. But again, you know, great use of space with a wine cooler, great European style cabinets. You've got light up drawers that open up. It's a I don't think you can catch that. Kitchen that. Kitchen. When you open the drawers, oh, they light. Sweet. Yeah, see, I'll do it again for you. Sweet. Yeah, very nice. Self closing, of course. It's a kitchen that, uh, if you have caterers, they're going to love the, it's you know, great. Yeah, the exactly. amount of work in counter space and cutting space they have in this kitchen. As if there's not enough in the main kitchen, too. But th this is really nice. What we did here is we did a separate dining room. We've done this house before without the uh, double sided fireplace. Double sided fireplace is fantastic. Uh, it, it kind of segregates the dining area a little bit, the formal dining area. Coffered ceiling with lights inside. Um, you can do a chandelier there if you like. Open stair. Open stair. What's nice in this home is there's also laundry in the lower level, laundry in the top level. So you've got two laundry rooms. Of course, you've got two furnaces and air conditioning units. The depth of this home is amazing. It's over 70 feet, uh, I'm guessing. I, well, if you were to guess, yes, probably. And we have the kind of molding that characterizes this builder also. The 8-inch molding. Again, energy star rated doors and windows. Great floor to ceiling lighting. Great party home, given Great the openness of this, and the depth of this space and the flow. Right. Out, out into the back deck, right. uh, probably have uh, 100 feet of flow from one end of the house to the opposite end of the deck. Yes, to the opposite end of the garage deck, you're right. At least 100 feet. So this is, you know, your formal, di depending on your lifestyle, but a formal dining area or entertaining area. We do have a nice family room in the lower level, so. And west-facing windows with a huge tree to cut your air conditioning bill. That's correct. <laughs> Which is which we do have high efficiency uh, carrier furnace in here, so. And we're looking down to a two-story well into the lower level. Yeah. Very dramatic. Which is when just, we get downstairs, you'll really get a sense for the light coming in, so. And it's just barely below grade. It's a it's less than a quarter below grade.